Hey, uh, okay. Uh, LP a classic VR time once again. Time for that. Okay, okay. First of all, we're finding a problem again, so hopefully I can keep it under control. Go. If I'm looking in weird directions, back why? I don't know why. Some. Ah, I got stop being cold. Anyway, but you know we can. Again, I don't want to bother anyone. Guy, probably kidding out here, but they can't hear me. I don't think. Any. Or they don't care. Um. Anyway, for take up code, we got. <laughs> Shanghai High Drink, you know, written by Tom Minton, with a story by the creator, which I'm gonna play up to him, I think, like it's playing from that song. But, um, anyway, so, we can be second of the vacation, the Pet Jet Epico, again, and we're telling Plague Bear off to Shanghai, because it's probably getting some kind of award for contributing, for being creator of Kung Fu Quilting. Love that continuity. And, and I um, Apparently, Kaida becomes great, get to meet her, she gets to meet her family, uh, you know, and, but of course, family is quite as she expected, and what's going on at the same time that the pet must do the dragon dance thing for the public ceremony, and that kind of goes from the chin and stuff. Okay, thank you all for seeing first of all, we got to come back first, and we're discussing the rap, damn food fighting, we you can't wear any rap at go, which is again a real weird moment, but they even asked for a comment when they're playing with that <laughs> But, that song's awesome, it's, I'm not a big rap fan, but I do like good rap, though. <laughs> you know, <laughs> I right, here you go. <laughs> um, in the cake, I believe in anyone in the end. <laughs> um, but I really think about that, the kind of rap that has that great flow, it doesn't, not just a bunch of minor grabbing, the flow, it's really good, I've got a lot of distance on both. All the kind, everyone get, and I like the beat. It's not only that, but got the, got that shiny beat up there, so it combined to create actually really unique beat. I think, you know, like, while we have a rap album, you have a really unique beat on kind of for rapping. I quite like them, and they're funny too. Okay, go with catch up the feeling of that pretty well. It got nothing on bubble from the Eagles, but you know. <laughs> Um, well, no one's swearing in this one, so, because you don't swearing in this one. Yeah, take it. <laughs> I killed. Um, so yeah, great song. Um, even though it's not even in the main plot. Um, so, um, uh, first of all, okay, we're, um, we're looking at up to take really advantage of the location. Well, I do like one of the jokes, like, my favorite joke might be when we're on the, the really fat tour, because you get the feeling that we got some more done. It, not to sell toy, but also to fill an educational quality to keep you up with the good thing. And with this one, they're making a joke about how they're forced to like put in some education stuff. We do it really quickly to get to the plot. Like the way that's the way the joke is. That could be, it's so funny. It's not not really the case, but I think that's funny. Um, and they're gonna not a ton of joke, but they're gonna do some joke. You know, you got stuff with. Roger gonna get cooked, so we can take up money. Probably in it, she gonna take up the money. Um, yeah, of course, you got, um, go. I should probably talk about some of the minor things before I get to the big bulk story of the episode. Um, the part, the part where the pecs are come mocking Ruffle for the fear of Goku ever. Mm, I don't like that part too much. I mean, they're not a big deal, but they're kinda mean. But, that, but they stop after a rap, so we had to go okay. But I do like how Huckle go between Nick and Adar told you he pretty paranoid to like go and stuff like that. He can be kinda of hinge when he wants to be. But we'll talk about that a bit more if we ever do head dragon black to bubble. Um you know. Um But anyway, um Um on to the main ball for Penny Um so, this is story I've <laughs> fat I just got Pan Reed I family a few weeks ago. <laughs> um Valka Love Kung Fu but I was dancing. Um <laughs> Um and he opposed damn food. I think he would have won a lot easier. <laughs> um But um but I the way it's done in pretty decent here. I gotta do you know, that whole more about how, you know you know, the family and how we have real family again. How she, you know, we're actually gonna have a ton of comma with them. And the relatives of them are pretty funny. I like their love for me, movie me cool. 
and yeah, you know, I got some other messy with packing with instant cookie, working everybody, and he and Pianu would get a character. What? Um, and if you can't get them, you know, I get Brian Drummond. <laughs> uh, um, you know, and uh, Penny, I she's a little annoying in some parts, but she gets better, so I can forgive that. Um, um, and I, the moral and content is pretty good, but much like making by I can keep going back and doing it, and that kind of a problem. But in the end, like in the end, she doesn't team up with the family and go hunky dory with them. But she she quote a bad guy for ditching the for dance thing for the with her family, which honestly I think a little more important. But can't time that can like kind of conflict. Like I can come back and doing that to basically gang. Hey, if you want to get her family, yeah, you're gonna go a lot better anyway. Like, you know, she didn't really ditch her family. She tried to put a balance in it. And she only could combine the family thing with that thing. I just can't, can be a contrude, and most people can't, but some can be more equally relevant. You know, but either way, in the concept, it is pretty good, and I like a lot of what goes on. You know, you know, the cap could definitely love the patch up because it was probably meant to be the deepest with the family element and uh you know, it worked, I do think, some part, you know. But I go a whole the Captain Code done a lot of what Logo Rep could do. I take advantage of getting off and telling a sort of solid story. And that's kind of making a play on Rio, I think. Like the story the way you focus on the getting stuff in the story was fine, but you need to combine them that because but I got not, Minka get Kong and she doesn't develop a grow or anything. Yeah, you know, I think like I got missed opportunity where the next one they took advantage of that and they do it in uh, the past one as well. If my luck that was next, but I don't know yet. But as a whole, it can go good, good episode. You know, it's getting pretty well. We got like, continuity, great song. The best song being a bad episode. We asked me, um, it was free and all the comedy again. Um, you know, and you like seeing can more than concept, even though it keeps saying it's perfect, but it's very nice moment. So. There you go. I bump up again. Love the fact I like and appreciate. Bump up the good edge of being watchable. You know, like playing on Rio. Um, I don't know why I'm bashing on I like it. You know, it's fun. Really. Like, Dory is my favorite. Oh, this one, Dory, a lot more interesting. You know, even my bunker like pretty minor, honestly. I love the stuff I like, I do like, and I love. I know people be my best rap, who look rap, and it's really good rap. You know? So, yeah, um, I like fun episode. Good element, so not one of my favorite sort of man not crazy about it. I like it. It's just and uh to be wary of some of the elements even the family thing, even though I have a good ending. Um okay, eight minutes, like okay. Surprisingly I did a lot okay, you might sat there with eight minutes, but either way mm, either way, we are moving on. Picking out net week target. Oh yeah, Shanghai drink is good, not my favorite kind of thing. Okay, next week. Get the key. Wait, five? Ooh, better check. Make sure we can pick a me. Back my penny for your laugh! Yay! <laughs> finally get to go deeper into that one. I shall see you all then. And finally clean up, Um just trying to Okay, cry for fun, and I'll see you on next week.